Hi, I'm Robert Deering, and I just want to thank you for taking the time to hear my heart about the House of Prayer and how I feel it is such an honor and a privilege to be able to give and support into the building of the House of Prayer in Michiana. When I think of the House of Prayer, I think of a lighthouse. A lighthouse is something that stands firm on its foundation. No matter how strong of storms may come its way or how strong of winds, it'll stand firm. And it also uses its light to penetrate any darkness that is around it so that people in the midst of that darkness, in the midst of those storms, can see that light and be drawn to it and know that it is a place of safety, a place of refuge. The reason I bring this up is because we are living in very dark times. We are living in the midst of storms. And we believe that the day of the Lord is near. Now, of course, we don't know the exact day or the exact hour, but Jesus says, like a woman with birth pains, we will see signs of the times of when that time will come and in, when it is near. And we believe that the day of the Lord is near and that a place of refuge and a place of safety is so crucial and so important. Now this doesn't mean safety by, by the strength of man or the power of man by any means, but a place of safety and refuge by the hand of God, knowing that it, a place set aside for His glory and His honor will be protected and a place of refuge and safety in the midst of these dark storms that are he, ahead of us. We also believe that the House of Prayer is a, is a place of bringing the reality in heaven down to earth, where right now the angels are singing, Holy, Holy, Holy is the Lord God Almighty, who was and is and is to come and where Jesus is interceding for us at the right hand of the Father. We too want to give the glory that is due to Jesus, that day and night worship would be exalted unto him, onto his throne, to have a place set aside to draw near to him and to experience his presence and experience his love more and more and be drawn closer to his heart. A place that is set aside to minister to his heart and a place to intercede and pray on behalf of the body of Christ and the be on behalf of our world, knowing and believing that at the sound of our voice, God's hand will move and our intercession will change things. So this is my heart of the house of prayer and what we as a body of Christ, body here at Voice believe is the heart of the house of prayer. And we just wanna ask you that if there's any way you guys could link arms with us and give and support into the building of the house of prayer here at the camp in Michiana, we would be so grateful. So thank you so much for taking the time to hear my heart and just hope you all have an awesome, blessed day. God bless you.